Welcome to Numeric Vectors Part 2. In this video we're going to learn how to explore the structure of a vector. So let's create a vector v that is just going to be 1, 5, 4, 3, 0, 0. Vectors come in different classes. The elements inside of v are all numeric. So the class of v is going to be numeric. But later on we'll run into other types of vectors that include only integers or character elements like text. We can see what kind of class we're working with with this class function. So if I type in class parentheses and then an object like v, R will tell you that v is numeric. We can also see how long a vector is with this length function. So if I type in length v then we'll see that v is of length 6. v has 6 elements. Probably the most useful function in R to explore the structure of an object is the structure function, which is just str. And then I can put in v, execute that, and the structure function tells me what the class of my object is. So num is short for numeric. This square bracket, 1 colon 6, is giving you information about the indexing of v. So what this means is that the indexing of v starts at 1 and then goes all the way through 6. In other words, v is of length 6. And then it just prints v by default. 